let's make ourselves some really cute little puppets. The ping pong balls, those will be the eyes of our puppets. The Google eyes, fur fabric is what we use for the hair, and a hot glue gun. Put the two seams together so that we've always got a smooth piece facing the front of the puppet. A bit of hot glue on either side, and these are the wiggly eyes that flop around a bit. So I'm putting one eye there, and one eye there. And when a puppet puts its eyes on, of course, suddenly it comes to life. Make sure that you don't have your hand inside the puppet, of course, when you put the hot glue on it. If you do burn your finger, you run it under cold water for at least 60 seconds. Now these eyes I'm using, instead of having the uh, googly eyes, I'm just using a couple of little black dots. But doesn't that look cute? Duh! Yeah! On the side of the puppet's cheek, right across the top of the eyes, and back down on the side of this cheek over here. Now the reason I like to do that is because it gives it so much more strength. The puppet then has eyebrows, hair, and those little bits that are glued to the side of the cheek on either side help to hold the eyes on. And she's not likely, likely to have her hair fall off or her eyes fall off. And then you can push that right down over there. And I've kept the fur running forward so that she's got lots of hair over her eyes like that. Long hair for the girl, shorter hair for the boy. And then after you've glued the front on, it's a good idea to come to the back and put a couple of little spots of glue at the back there so that the hair is held down at the back and it doesn't flop up and flop all over the place. I'm going to take the bottom of the puppet and cut some arms off. That's just a matter of cutting a small strip at the bottom, which becomes the arms. The place where the seam is, where the puppet joined, becomes a nose, if you want a nose. I'm going to cut up there. Now we'll make the arms thinner at the top, on either side. The thumb comes across about the same place as your knuckles there. So we want to cut a little piece out of that, and that piece becomes the thumb, the short bit. I'll cut down there like that, and then puppets only have two, three fingers, like that. So two cuts down there gives us the three fingers. So if you put those on either side, you've got two hands for your puppet. Now I've put a mark just below the joint of the mouth, the hinge of the mouth, about 20 maybe 30 millimeters down from there. Now always make sure of course that the thumb is pointing forward on your puppet. Put a spot of hot glue right on that mark, round about 30 millimeters down from the corner of the mouth and squeeze it in place. Same again on the other side. Now that little piece that was left over we want to use as a nose. A nose is optional of course some people don't want them. I'll put a strip of glue right up the middle there, squeeze that piece together, and stick that in there, and our puppet has a nose. I've got uh, some of these uh, little pieces of fluff. They're called fur balls. You can pick them up from craft shops as well. And to make him a bit more of a character, I'm going to glue a couple of these pieces of fluff in here, like that. And of course we give him a couple of buck teeth at the front. So I'll put a couple of teeth down the bottom there too. So now our young fella's got some teeth. Way to go. <laughs> His arms will need to come through there. Around about there. And there. So you can either use a knife. Or a pair of scissors. Down on there and tuck his arm through that. And his other arm through that slit. And bring this around the front. And now our puppet's got a shirt. But you'll just want to put a tack of glue down the center. Stick that front of the shirt over there. Tack of glue down that side. Front of the shirt over there. You could put buttons on it if you like. And I'm going to tack down that collar and that collar. And our little lad's now got a shirt with a collar. So there we go. One little boy puppet. Hey, I need a name now. Oh, you do need a name, don't you? And one little girl puppet. Call me Henrietta. <laughs> hey, don't kiss me. Yuck. <laughs>